What's up, guys? Desert B here with more Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. We uh, got the bunny hood last episode, so that's gonna really come in handy. I... I feel so much faster with this thing. So, um, next order of business is gonna be to go help out the Gorons. So we're headed to, um, Snowhead. I always get confused. I'm pretty sure it's Snowhead, right? I get confused with Snowhead and Snow Peak, but I'm pretty sure Snow Peak is the where the Yetis live in Twilight Princess. Okay, I don't know why I'm wasting time doing that. Let's go. Whoa. Oh my god. There's a baby Dodongo. I wonder if it's worth me killing him. Oh, what? You don't do his tail? Oh. I don't have any bombs. Okay. I'll leave him alone. There's another one. Wait, uh... Where do I go? Is there not a path? Here we go. Okay. And then the, uh... Yeah, this is like the... The gatekeeping thing here so that you will wouldn't be able to do the temples... Oh. Out of order, you'd have to do the, um... The forest temple first so you can get this bow. Otherwise, you wouldn't be able to get in here at all. Definitely different from Breath of the Wild, because, you know, you could do... You can do anything in Breath of the Wild in any order you want to. Oh, spider! I always forget which... Which R button is my shield? God, I can't get over how fast this, uh, bunny hood is. It's, like, incredibly fast. I think, honestly, I think I'm even faster with this than with Epona. It's kind of like, what even is the point? Other than just, you know, to save her, what is, what is the point to, to saving her? Do I have bombs yet? No. Am I going to have to blow my face up? I assume I got to use bombs to get through that. Lord. Hmm. Well, at least I have the mask. This is no good. If we could just blast these snowballs out of the way, we could get through. Well, we can. <laughs> at the cost of one heart or half a heart piece. Whoops. I'd much rather find bombs, though. Do these things not spawn? Ow. Magic, but no bombs. What does this say? Mountain village ahead. Beware of blizzards and deep snow. Goron should be able to break the snow boulders easily. That's such an odd bit of information at the end, but serves as a, uh, I guess, a little bit of a... Wow, still no bombs. A little bit of foreshadowing there that our next mask will be the Goron mask. Mountain Village. Here we are. It's like a snowy cabin. I wouldn't mind being in a snowy cabin at the moment. Oh, the music here is kind of cool. It's kind of like haunted. There's an owl. And what does this say? Mountain Smithy ahead. We sharpen any sword. We work hard so your sword works hard for you. Ooh, I think I remember this though. I think I remember there's like a whole quest line. 
<laughs> oh, he doesn't speak words. Shut up. Just when I was having a good dream. Oh, welcome to the mountain smithy where we take our time to make a good point. I'm Zuboro. Zubora, the owner. Pleased to meet you. And back to random uh, letters, I guess. Uh, that huge fellow is my assistant, Gebora. He's all brawn and about as smart as a DQ stick. Say, did you come here to have your sword sharpened? Unfortunately, we're not doing any business right now. It's because of this abnormal cold snap we've been having. See, our hearth is all frozen over. The way things are going now, we won't be able to do any business until spring. If I could just do something about that frozen hearth. Is it hearth? Hearth? I don't know. <laughs> What's that? You say if we had hot water, we could melt the ice off the hearth? Don't act like you know what you're talking about, you Deku stick. Oh, he believes a rumor that says long ago there were hot springs somewhere in the mountains near here. Ah, I don't believe such rubbish. Can we talk about his shirt choice, though? Like... Why are his nipples out? That's just... Uncomfortable. Alright, let's, um... Oh, this is frozen. Whoa. Up here. Up here. I'm sorry to bother you from such a high place. But I'm very hungry and I have gotten stuck here. Oh, what a bummer. It's so cold. I'm so very hungry. I don't think I'm gonna make it. I just want to eat once more before I die up here. Something tough and hard to chew. I cannot forget that flavor. Goodness. He's asking me to bring him his final meal. This way to Snowhead, beware of the Slippery Valley Trail and the giant falling snowballs. Okay, let's go ahead and take care of this. All right. Bombs, finally! I wonder if I should spend any time... Oh, and a fairy! Hold on now. Well, wait a minute. I feel like I'm gonna need this bottle for hot water, so I guess... Whatever. I got five bombs. I just don't know if I should be breaking any of these apart? Wow. What a waste. What is this over here? Deep water. Gorons beware. Gorons who can't swim shouldn't play near here. Do Gorons swim at all? Seems like they're too heavy for that. I just... Come on, Link, just roll right into the tree. There you go. Nothing. Okay, so... What's this way? Goron village ahead, okay. What was the other sign? It was telling me some something else. I think Goron village is where I want to go. Mountain village is... One... One building. Oh, one shop. Ow. Ow! You jerk. Well, there's, uh, Tingle. I hope he's selling me- Oh, whoa! I hope he's selling maps for 27 rupees or less. Oh, man. Well, that was easy. Sorry to do this to you, Tingle. <laughs> that can't be good for the knees. What's this? Oh, he says the same thing every time. My name is Tingle. And he's 35. Um, What do you got for me? What do you got? 20 rupees for Snowhead, and then Romani Ranch. Perfect. 
Thank you, Tingle. Thank you. Always a pleasure. So here's where that spring water will come in handy, wherever wherever that is. Oh, another wolf! Wow. One jump jump attack to the back and he's a goner. Wow, I cannot explain to you guys how much I'm loving this bunny hood. Aw oh man, these poor Gorons. It's cold. Being the gatekeeper in this cold is hard. Do you want to enter the Goron Shrine? Well, can I, let me look around first. Just give me a minute. Oh, look, you can see the other temple from here. That's, um, Icona? I think. Uh, let's see. Where can I go? I think I hear more spiders. What is that? Oh! God, leave me alone. Some arrows. Oh, here's a Deku scrub. I don't have a... Uh... Oh, look! It's the owl! Kepora Gebora or Gebora Kepora? I can never remember. We meet again, fairy child. Have my stone statues been of help? Well, it seems you may have the strength to change the fate of this land as I had expected, but the road ahead is even more challenging. Many trials await you. Please watch over these Gorons around you. Their land is doomed to be smothered in snow and ice forever. It will become a land where no living thing can survive. Without courage and determination, you surely will collapse from the extreme conditions. But if that courage and determination burns bright within you, then that's another story. Will you proceed? Yep. You are a child of many strengths. Well, perhaps you do have enough strength to change the fate of this mountain after all. I shall take to the air now, flying toward that shrine across the way. So follow behind me. Do not be daunted by appearances. Instead, let your feelings guide you and the true path shall open up before you. Are you ready? Follow behind me. Wow, okay. That was a lot. A lot of talk of courage there. Um, uh, follow him. Oh god, I almost jumped. Oh, I see, I see. Here we go. Ah! <gasps> Is it slick? <gasps> Link! Do these, uh, do these feathers despawn? Oh my god, they do! You are kidding me! Night of the first day, come on, wait. My feathers! Ah! Wait, come back. It seems things are not going well for you. Fear not. It never goes well at first for anyone. But by no means should you grow impatient. Impatience brings uneasiness and distracts the heart. Yeah, let me try it again. All right, I gotta be faster. Why do his feathers despawn? Okay, let's go. And it, like, really sucks that these things are slippery. Ah! Alright, just leap of faith it. Leap of faith. And here we go. Careful. Ah! <gasps> Link, no! <laughs> okay. Let's try it again. Goodness. I like, I panicked and tried to run the other way because I thought I was slipping and then I jumped. Involuntarily, I jumped. This is back before the days of the hero being able to just jump whenever he wants. And right now I'm completely reliant on this auto jump system. Made it. I have certainly been assured of your courage and determination. From here on, you must not be fooled by appearances. You must rely on your feelings. Now enter the shrine. Something that will aid you in your quest lies within. Use that item when returning from here. My god. Rely on your feelings? That had nothing to do with feelings. Bombs! Ooh, yeah! 
Lots of bombs. I wonder if they want me to, like, blow up these rocks. Oh. Nice. My face is beaming with happiness. Is that what it said? <laughs> Accurate. Can we do the spin attack? There we go. What's after me? Oh, I know what this is. We're getting the lens. You got the lens of truth. Gaze through it to see mysteries that are invisible to the naked eye. Seeing the truth drains magic power. Okay. Well, that's awesome. Can I... I wonder if I can use the bunny hood and the lens at the same time. Actually, let's do that. And then this here. Ooh, I can. Nice. Oh, and there's hidden chests in here, too. More rupees. Did I get all the hidden? I guess so. All right. Wow, look at that. Oh. Whoa. All right, slow down. Oh, hello. Can it be? Are you able to see me? If you truly can see me, then follow behind me. Okay. Well, slow down. Where are we going? Okay, so this must be... We're going to get the, the Goron mask from this guy for sure. Ow. Okay. Never mind. He's got some... Looks like he's got tattoos on his left arm. Leave me alone. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, the wolf. <laughs> I think I'll skip the wolf. Oh, oh gosh. Okay, wait. Oh, the wolf is coming too. I hear him up there. How do I get back up? Now where's, uh... Where's this ghost at? There he is. Oh, he's coming. Still got a hit on me? Come on. Need a longer sword. Or a longer reach. Oh. Where is he? Hello? Should I have not gone through? Wait a minute, where did he go? I thought he went through this uh, little doorway. Did I lose him? Oh, well that's new. Should I just go up there? This is weird. It seems like he would have been right there waiting for me. I bet you could do this even without the mask or the lens. It would take some trial and error, but it looks like it's not exactly complicated. 
Well, I'm just going to go up here and see if this is where he was going. Considering that I just got the lens and this is only uh, viewable when you have the lens, I'm assuming this is where he went. Oh, there's Gorons up here. This is the grave where a Goron hero rests. I came here to put up the great hero's memorial, but the return route has been blocked by snow and I can't get back to Goron village. And even worse, my brother's been frozen solid from the cold. The way things are looking, I'll be frozen too. Oh, it's times like this that make me wish I had taken some of the hot spring water I found when I was digging the hero's grave. But the hot spring is now covered by the gravestone. I can't move a gravestone that big by myself. But I guess this is what's meant by the Goron saying, there's no use in crying over spilt rocks. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Oh, good. He's here. He's kind of scurry. He's that, that big old gash on his stomach. The Soaring One said the one who could see me would be arriving soon. It seems that it turned out to be true. I'm Darmani, the third. The blood of proud Goron heroes runs in me. This feels strange for me to say, but when I was alive, I was a renowned warrior and veteran. Yes, when I was alive. His teeth. But alas, I am now dead. <laughs> I was fine until I marched off to Snowhead by myself, hoping that I could drive off a demon. It had been wreaking havoc on Goron Village. Then the blizzard at Snowhead blew me into the valley, and now here I am. How infuriating. As I am, I can only watch as Goron Village is slowly buried in ice. I may have died, but I cannot rest. So you can use magic. The Soaring One also told me that you are able to use it. I beg you, bring me back to life with your magic. If it is beyond your power, then I beg of you to do this for me instead. Heal my sorrows. Any way that you can do it will suffice. Please, heal my sorrows. Okay, so... Yeah, he, uh, song of healing, I guess, for this guy. And He's got, uh, interesting features. Oh, I, what is the song of healing exactly? Left, right, down. This is the only thing I can do for you. Peel your face off and trap your soul in it so that I can wear it on my own face. Sounds, uh, healing. What a soothing melody. My sorrows are melting away into the song. <laughs> Are they cheering him on? Looks like it. Celebrating his life. Wow. I don't remember getting a cutscene like that. Oh. Well, that's a, that's a bit cuter than his actual face was. I leave my undying feelings with you. The deeds I accomplished while living are carved on my grave. You should read it. You got the Goron mask. This mask contains the spirit of a proud Goron hero. Wear it with C to inhabit the body of a Goron. Okay. For the Goron village, I have asked your assistance. It's written in letters you have never seen before. Oh, what? He said that we should read it, but I really can't. Grab. Oh, you know what? They said um, that there was hot spring water under the Goron's gravestone. <laughs> oh, it's so terrifying. Check me out. <laughs> what the butt butt bump? <laughs> nice. Oh yeah. 
It's a little slow, but powerful. Okay, so I think now maybe I can grab this. No? Oh, here we go. Oh, wow. It fills the, the entire little base in here up. How long does hot spring water stay hot? Actually, eh. Well, whatever. You filled your bottle with hot spring water. It doesn't say how long it lasts. It just says before it gets cold. Well, I can unfreeze the guy right here. You, you're, no, you're not Darmani, the great Darmani, are you? Then just whose grave was I making? Did you come back to life because it was so warm beneath your grave? Hey, okay, I guess, oh, oh gosh, whoops. I guess I kind of look like Darmani. Come back to life so that you can freeze again. What have I been doing? Oh, you're all right, brother. You were frozen, but the great Darmani saved you. The great Darmani? What's with you? Are you half asleep? Did you hear this guy? The great Darmani died long ago and is lying in his gr- Hey, Darmani! I was shocked too, but somehow it seems the great Darmani isn't dead. Really? With this, a star of hope appears in Goron Village. Great Darmani, please do something about the blizzard blowing in from Snowhead. Okay. Great. So now I can go haunt the entire village that thinks their hero died. But what I am going to do is take some of this water. I don't know what I need it for yet, but there's definitely I saw along the way that there were a couple of Ice blocks that I could use it on. I wish I had more than one bottle. I think I could jump. Woo! All right, made it. Awesome. Wait, which way? I don't know what what exactly is in the other direction, but I think I want to head back to the Goron Village. Is this the right way? No! My water's gonna get called. Well then what's this way? Yeah, this is the right way, I think. Yeah, see I can use the water on that. Ooh. I know that as a Goron I can roll. But I don't know if I'm fast and oh gosh, I don't know if I'm fast enough Or well, yeah, I don't know which is faster, but this is definitely easier to control Okay, watch it I need hearts. Oh Here's more hot spring water A stick Hmm. This doesn't heal me? Come on. Let's see if I can get some hearts. No hearts. And these things seem to respawn. Ah! Hmm. I guess, uh, oh, there's a chest. Wow. Okay, well, darn it. I guess we'll have to go out and look for hearts. So good to know there's a... Uh, more hot spring water there. I don't know what else I need it for. Dawn of the second day.
Maybe I better slow time down. Let's see. Slowing it down is backwards, which is always hard for me to remember. So, that's forward. Mm, darn it, I messed it up. There we go. It's so hard to do that in my head for some reason. Slow the current flow of time. Because we still have to go into this village and talk to the Gorons here. And... Then, I guess, prepare to go into the temple. And that one guy asked me if I wanted him to open up the temple. Or the... Was it the temple? I don't know. He asked me something. That's where I got the lens of truth. What is this? It's talking to me. Like it's a... Uh... Huh. Oh! Okay. I wonder how you would... My hot spring water cooled. Well, darn it. Oh well, I don't even know what I needed it for. So where's that guy that was going to open a door for me? I'm too slow. Oh. All right. There's a heart piece up there. Oh, I bet I'd have to get that um, thing for him. Goron Shrine. See the gatekeeper. Bam. I don't need a gatekeeper. <laughs> oh, I remember this. Goodness. I wonder... Let's get this off of me. Way too slow. Uh, hi guys. I wish someone would do something. I can feel it pounding in the back of my head. Well, hold on a few minutes longer. I gotta look for hearts. What is this anyways? Some torches? More torches. There's a path over here. I'm just like, I really want to refill my health. They're giving me everything but hearts. That's terrible. This is the room of the Goron tribe's elder. Do you have some kind of business with the elder? Unfortunately, he's out. Since the elder's gone, his son won't stop crying. I wish someone would do something. My word. Okay, well, let's see. If I can do something about him. Give him one of these. His little single tooth in the front. Daddy, I'm cold. That's it? We're at our wit's end. The elder went to Snowhead and doesn't seem to be coming back. Now his son is so lonely that he won't stop crying. It keeps getting colder outside and inside. We're so cold we can freeze. Okay, so we gotta go find his father. And honestly... I don't know that I want to spend another second in here until I do find his father. I just wish I could get some hearts. 
All right, let's go. Lordy, that's horrible. Really a DQ seed, but no hearts. Okay, so from what I remember, his father is somewhere between like here and that town. So, oh, hearts. Oh, ah, E. Goodness. So let's go back. Look around. Yeah, isn't he like in one of these snowballs? All right. Whoa, the camera. Arts! All right, that was worth it. Let's take a look. I guess, uh, I don't know. Is this the only way I can break them? Oh, there's a chest down there. Yeah, that, oh gosh. Hello. The, the roll is really hard to control. Aha, yes, I remember this. Okay. Now I need hot spring water, which, what if I just give you a one, two? Oh, really? Okay, I'll take that. There was hot spring water right up here in this hole. Yeah, he's definitely, uh, kind of big and lumbers around. Alrighty, let's go. Nope. I think he was right over here. Kind of where that chest thing is on the map. One of these, right? Oh, it, it even glows green. Okay. Oh! Oh my gosh, I do it every time. Whoops. I just want to get close. Oh, too close. <laughs> Sorry. There we go. Wow, dude, you have quite the hump on your back. What was I doing? It's already this late? I must hurry. Hey, um, hello. You're Darmani, but you're supposed to be dead. Am I hallucinating? Maybe this is also the doing of Snowhead's magic power. I've been made a fool of, but that's impossible. I refuse to flinch. If I can see past the illusion, I'll, you'll vanish in an instant. No. What? My son is crying because he misses me. Yeah. Make him stop. Why do you know that? My son misses me. Forgive me, my child. Your father has work to do. Darmani, be you a ghost or a figment of my imagination, I no longer care. If you feel pity for my crying son, then please, quietly sing my son to sleep with this song I'm about to play on my drum. It's the very same melody that was often played for you when you were young. He carries a drum. How does the song go? Huh? Let me play it once more. Um... Ah, uh, yes, like this. It's no good. I can I can only remember the beginning. I'll just teach you the beginning. 
Okay, it's three notes repeated. Awesome. I don't know what this guy thinks he's gonna do in Snowhead Temple. He's like on his deathbed. You played the lullaby intro. <laughs> he's really getting down on those drums. You learned the lullaby intro, the soothing melody of a thoughtful father. It's not that I forgot it, it's just so cold that I can't play very well. At any rate, I'm counting on you. Goodness, dude, you need to... You need to get inside. Somewhere warm. Okay, so now we gotta go play that for... The child. Hey, whoa, god. Hey, just get, get out of my way and I'll let you live. All right. Is this it right here? Oh yeah, I think it is. Goron Link has way more moves than Deku Link even. Ooh. Dang, that was cool. All right, guys. I am here to soothe this crying child. What was the song? I already forgot. Lullaby intro, A, right, left. A, right, left. Yeah. That song, that's the song daddy always plays for me before I go to sleep. I'll sing the next part. <laughs> it was two notes! Wow. Okay. Good, now will you stop crying? The Goron Lullaby. He's still shivering, the poor guy. Aww. Oh, good. Just like daddy's right beside me. <laughs> Perfect. Ooh. The lullaby intro became the Goron's lullaby. This lullaby blankets listeners into calm while making eyelids grow heavy. Oh. Goodness. Put them all to sleep. So I see a couple things here. For one, there's like an obvious ramp. And, uh... There's also a bunch of torches. So I guess I'll try to do the torch thing. And other than that, I think I'm pretty set to go into the temple. All right, so this might take me a couple tries since I didn't really look to see where all these are before I started. My word, there's a bunch. How long does my stick last? Okay, uh... Ah, no! Is that all of them? Oh, this one. Oh. Okay. So I'm thinking use the little ramp to roll into the chandelier. This is the same uh, Goron City music from Ocarina of Time. Let's go get a nice long start. Hey. 
And... Did anything happen? Does not appear so. All right. Oh, gosh. Yeah, this is... It's really hard to control this. I hope the... The temple doesn't have me using it in tight spaces. I guess we just have to break them all. All right. That's pretty easy, though. I wonder if his dad's gonna make it home. He did not look like he was in good condition. What is that? Oh, you know what? This looks like a rock roast from Breath of the Wild. You know, the, I think this is why I'm like really interested in replaying these games is because, well, for one thing, I'm just like really, really looking forward to Tears of the Kingdom and I want to replay some Zelda games to uh, just kind of wait around for the game to come out, I guess. But I also think it's really interesting to sort of see, like, I, I have played older Zelda games, and I thought that the rock roast in Breath of the Wild, that was like the first time that they'd ever had those. But look, here we are. Majora's Mask, released 2000. Here's a rock roast. I think that's really fun to sort of see... Um, maybe where this sort of stuff originated, or just see how it was used in previous games. And it'll, it'd be fun too, because when we finally do get to play Tears of the Kingdom, it'll all be like fresh in our minds, and, um, you know, stuff that we see in Tears of the Kingdom will be like, oh yeah, that was from whatever game. And okay, so where I'm going right now, is there was some dude out here that was hungry and he wanted his last meal to be something tough. Aha, there he is. So let's see if I can uh, help him out. That's it. It's so good that I dream about it. Dodongo's Cavern's finest quality rock sirloin. Okay, so it's not a rock roast, but it's a rock sirloin, whatever. This is my absolute favorite. Blessed be this meal. <laughs> <laughs> Why is he wearing a frog on his head? My energy has returned to me. I'm coming down now. Wait a moment. Good job. You made it. You'll live to see another day. Oh, I wondered who it might be. Why, if it isn't Armani. You're alive? Yes, I see. That is the reason why you knew my favorite food. Oh, I almost forgot. Please accept this as a token of gratitude. Oh, it was a mask. You got Don Garrow's mask. It looks just like Don Garrow, conductor of the Frog Choir. It was crafted so well that no one would even think twice if you were to di direct the Frog Choir. I hope that spring will come soon so that I can hear the frog's enthusiastic performance. Hope as I might, it's still cold. I'm going back to Goron Village. Okay, so remember that frog? There was a mini boss in the Woodfall Temple. And after we killed it, it turned into uh, a little frog. That's what that was for. This way to Snowhead. Okay, so this was the other way. And obviously before I go into the temple, I will reset time, but I just want to look and see if there's... Ooh, here we go. First use of this. Wait a minute, I'm not ready. I don't know how fast I need to be going. Oh! Nice! Can I blast these? Oh good, I can.
Oh, yeah. Oh. Whoops. A little too slow on that one. Oh, wow. Okay. Another little jump. And there's a frosty bat. Oh no! Uh, I wonder if I have to be... I guess I gotta be like this. Full speed. Ah! Oh god, it's so hard to control. Eek! Oh no. <laughs> okay, let's try it again. Okay, up and over. Now let me just like, just calm down. Calm. Everybody calm down. Oh, yeah. Perfect. Great. Get that one out of the way. Now we need a running start. Oh, no! I gotta get... some speed behind me before I can cross this. But how... Come on! Ah! What the heck? How do you get over this thing? This right here is gonna be the biggest challenge. This is what I was worried about. Oh! Made it. I wanna read the sign. This way to Snowhead Temple. Please contact the Goron Elder if you have any information on the whereabouts of the Temple Guard. What the heck? Snowhead. What was that? Oh, thank God. There's a one of these. How is Link out here in nothing but a, a tunic? Okay, so... Stop that. What does this say? Snowhead Temple. High winds ahead. Gusts and snow flurries may blow careless travelers off the cliffs. Oh, yeah. I can already see. But there's a... <laughs> the teeth. Why'd they make the teeth so funny on these Gorons? But, um... Maybe, do I need to be a Goron? I just gotta put him to sleep, right? I think I remember this. A, right, left. A, right, left. Right, A. Let's see if I can remember that. Oops. A, right, left. Did it work? Oh, yeah. His little goatee. Perfect. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, he'll probably be fine. Oops. Okay. I think, uh, I think with that, we're good to go into the temple. We'll just get up here and make sure that the path is more or less cleared. I'll probably have to, oh, two wolves, huh? Oh, God. Uh, target, please. Come on. Well, come on, hit me. Good job. Oh, these ones. Got a little extra fight in them. I don't want two at once.
Oh, that's the trick. You gotta get them in their backs. Okay. All right, well, I will um, reset time and then meet you guys back here. And in the next episode, we'll head into the temple. All righty. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. Goodbye. Oh. He's fine. Okay. Goodbye. I'm Brittany with Desert Bee Games. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video and you'd like to help my channel grow, all you gotta do is hit the like and subscribe buttons below. Thanks again, and I'll see you next time for more.